Hey guys and gals, it's your guy Cool Wheels. I hope you guys are doing great today. I'm at a Hobby Lobby. Yep, I'm at a Hobby Lobby. I have not been to this one. So let me find the cars where they haven't located this one and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys and gals, I've located the uh, cars here at the Hobby Lobby. So let's see what we can find. They've got quite a bit here hanging on the pegs. We've got a good selection here at this Hobby Lobby. It's the first time I've been to this one, as I said. So let's see what we can find here. And let's just do a run through. That's a nice looking Ford Bronco right there. 1967, wow. We got a black bandit here. Pretty nice right there. We got a 76 Ford F-150. We got another black bandit back there. 22 Corvette, Chevrolet. Uh, we got another one back there. We got a Volkswagen. For all you Volkswagen fans out there. That one's pretty cool. Red Crown Volkswagen Type 2, double cab pickup. Oh man, I see one I already like. <laughs> It's not a greenie. It's not a greenie, but... Wow, let me get it off here. Wow, this one is so sweet. Wow, I like this one. Flower Power. Reminds me of Austin Powers. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow, that is really nice. Check out the top of the camper. That is definitely old school. Wow, what is this? A 1973 Volkswagen Type 2. Wow, Camper Mobile. That is so cool. Wow, that is cool on Cool Wheels. Where everything is cool. Oh, we got a Johnny Lightning. We got another one back there. What is that? That's a 2012 Camaro ZL1. That is a convertible. Wow, I guess that one. Let me pull this over here so you guys can see it. I hope that I guess the top of that pulls back. This is a convertible. That one's 13 bucks. We got some cabbage patch. Well, we got these zingers. We got the twin pack. I've seen these at the other Hobby Lobby I was at, but I didn't see this one. <laughs> Let you guys and gals take a look at this one if you're into collecting these cars here. Nine bucks, not bad sweet looking car man it got it jacked up in the back i like to give you guys the best video the best content here on cool wheel so you guys can see the cars that are out there uh always like to take my time as much time as i can at each stop let you guys take a look what they've got because i know you're like me you can't get to every hobby lobby or get to every place that has cars our diecast life is busy right Things to be done. We've got another Johnny Lightning back there. We got one here. We got a, another one here. That's limited edition. That is a, is that a Camaro, right? Yeah, that's a ZL. Yeah, that's a Camaro. I'm sorry, Z, ZL1. There you go. That's what I thought. Uh, try to get these back here. Got one here, muscle car. It's a 73 Pontiac. We got one way back there. Oh, this one's nice here. They got two of these. Wow, that's a 1969, yeah. Chevrolet Camaro SS. That's a 396. That thing will roll. SS. We got a haze here. Nice, I've seen that truck, I think, somewhere. Turtle, turtle, oh, turtle wax. We got the drag. I'm gonna try to move this stuff around. We got another one here. We got another one. And we got one back there. A couple of those. Well, and for you Metal Yellow fans, got one right here, Metal Yellow. Sprite, oh, I've seen this one. Another turtle, turtle. Oh boy, another turtle. Another turtle, another turtle. What was that, five turtles? No. Yeah, that's five turtles, wow. I see these in a lot of the Hobby Lobbies. We got some tractor for your tractor fans out there that collect these down on the farm. Oh, this one's nice. Ladies, this is perfect for you. 
for all my lady subscribers out there this one's perfect for you not just because it's pink but it's cool looking be nice to your collection uh, I don't even know how much these are. Oh, they're $6. You know, I never paid attention how much the the punch buggies were. Okay, we did all these now. We got a hitch here. Uh, I did look at that one. I just threw it over there. I think we looked at these. Did not look at this one. Or did I? I think I did. I think I was showing it off. Uh, I seen this one at the last Hobby Lobby. So we did this. I'll just make sure I'm not passing up anything. We got some Pacific. We got some war ones. Four vehicles, got a tank back there. Uh, we got a 69 Ford Bronco Baja. Those Bajas are pretty cool, especially in the Hot Wheel ones. We got some Dually here. Yeah, we got another one here, this red one. We got one back there. We got a 69. Yeah, we got the Mod Squad right here. We got racing champs, racing champs. We got Fast and Furious, the little mini ones if you're into collecting those. We got a couple of these busts. We see these around. We got some King of Crunch. Right there, we got another King of Crunch. 1987 GMC. We got Hot Pursuits. If you guys are into these, we got a couple of these here. The Hobby Lobby. Another hot pursuit. And uh, there's another one back there, 2018 Ram. Uh, I showed you guys these, I think. Yeah, these are everywhere. I don't know if anybody is actually buying those, but that UPS one, that one is nice. I like the flames that they did on that one. That's pretty cool. They should actually do one for real. People will be like, man, let's check that out. A couple of these. We got some Just Trucks here, 1955. We got a 1958. Wow, check that old truck out. That's pretty cool at the Hobby Lobby. Let's see, we got some of these clues. We got another clue. Clue. Wow, they do they got five clues. We got five clues and five turtles. Oh, they're getting too much of those in. Got some SD trucks. We got some hitch here. We got a hitch back there. Another hitch right there. Oh, we got these RoboCops too. Remember at the other Hobby Lobby, I showed you the RoboCop, the 35th anniversary car. I don't see it here. Maybe I should have bought that one now that I'm looking at here, but they got two of these, $22, set you back. But if you're into collecting that kind of stuff, you get the trailer, you get the car. It looks like the police car right on the top there. It's kind of hard to see. I know there's some glare on the camera. Yeah, with these, got two of these. Let's see here, got packs here. This one was pretty cool right here. This is probably my favorite one right there. The bus. It's pretty cool. Too bad it's not a greenie. Uh, Hot Pursuit, I think I showed you these. Nope, I didn't look at these yet. We got another King of Crunch. Oh, I did show you guys this. I'm sorry, I just moved the Hot Pursuit over. Okay, I'm repeating myself. All right, let's move down here. Look like we got some low riders in here. Yes, we got a lowrider right here. We got a 1972 Cadillac Coupe de Ville. Wow. I think I saw this one at the other Hobby Lobby. I'm almost positive I did. These look familiar. There's another one here. 1970 Chevrolet Monte Carlo. You know, I actually liked the Monte Carlo back in the days. I believe my we actually had one. Yep. Oh, this one's really nice. A 64 Chevrolet Impala. Now, that's a nice car. The Impalas, when it's done right, this one's really nice. If you see the roof right there, they did a nice... Got the pinstripe. Yep. That's pretty cool. Let me put these back up on the peg here. Oh, we got some Smoky Bears. 1995. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We got another one here. Great outdoors. Oh, great. Another smoky bear. We got another one back there. Not really much to see as far as these are. I don't know if you're into you guys are into collecting the, the great outdoors or the smoky bears. Uh we got one here. 
always just kind of take a look at the bottom sometimes if I'm not sure because sometimes they're green but if it's a greenie they'll definitely stick out that color we got fire rescue we got first responders yep yep and we got another one here I don't see any uh nope I'm just looking around while I'm videoing and we got some muscle machines we'll take a look at here. Got a nice one right here. Yep. Very nice. That's a 66 Dodge Charger. Wow. Big block on the top. Got the blower up there. We got another muscle machine here. Uh, I want to thank one of my subscribers on one of my other Hobby Lobby uh, episodes uh, pointed out to me that there was a chase in this. And I actually had it in my hand, but I didn't buy it because I'm not really into collecting these. But I want to thank that subscriber again for pointing that out for me if I just missed it. As I said, nobody's perfect, right? Especially when it comes to collecting die-cast cars. There's so much variety in cars and stuff. But I don't see anything else as far as on the peg uh, that I looked. I didn't see any uh, greenies or chase here. Uh, I think that's gonna be it here. They got some large cars down here. High pursuit. High pursuit. Uh, there might be a. Yep, I've seen this one. Remember in the last video or the time before I show you guys two of these? No, a couple of videos back, Hobby Lobby, on my road trip. Some of these were brand new in the package. They were actually in the shopping cart. If you remember where I found the uh, the Ford, I think 250, uh, Greeny. Yeah, they were still in the package or in that tissue wrap. They've got a couple of these small ones here. We've seen these. These are just like do-overs to me. Uh, this one I don't think I've seen. It's probably new. They've got some haulers here. 1968. Another hauler there. Uh, they got the muscle machines. they got one. Uh, I think we got one more back there. Yep, some M2s, but nothing really to see. And they got one gas pump, no part. So, guys and gals, I don't see anything, uh, uh, oh well. Sometimes, you know, you, sometimes you find, sometimes you just don't find, you know? This is sometimes how it goes. That's nice there. Well, I always like to go back a little bit before and just to make sure I didn't just overpass a J-hook and I missed a car I wasn't paying attention to because so much to look at here. Uh, let me just go down and check back here real quick on these here. Yep, let me just double check and make sure I didn't pass anything by mistake. Volkswagen, oh, those are my favorite too, Volkswagen Bugs. The Beatles. Yeah. Well, guys and gals, I, I think that's going to be it. Uh, well, let me take a swing over here real quick. Sometimes I forgot to swing over here because I always have these uh, electric ones here. With the track, the slot cars. Let's go over and check. Matter of fact, I think they do have a chase in these guys too, but I don't have one of these tracks to run these cars. I guess maybe one day I'll invest in buying the actual track. And when I was a kid, I used to have this amazing figure eight track for electric cars, for these slot cars. Whew, man, I had fun on that. I had awesome time when I was a kid with my track. Yep, it's a figure eight. It's a smoke. I used to have it just black lines on here where I had smoked the rover by holding the car down, just kind of tilting a little bit and let those tires just burn. <laughs> wow, that was cool. Oh, uh, the old days. Anyway, it's pretty cool. Uh, I don't see anything else here, guys and gals. Uh, I like the tracks. I'll 114 bucks for that one. Electric track. Uh, that one is probably the same one, right? Now this one's $69, so it's smaller, but... Oh, so it shows you the figure of the track. Kind of like an eight. Not an oval. That one, I think this one is... Uh, oh, this one's larger, yeah. You can see here. These are really nice. And if you can find like an old, old one, an original one, probably the best ones. All right, guys and gals, if you've got a bunch of models, they're 40% off here at the Hobby Lobby. Come and get your model kits. I used to do those too, by the way. 
Anyways, I don't see anything else here at this Hobby Lobby. Uh, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Cool Wheels. Uh, guys, remember to take care of yourself. Take care of your family. And we take care of each other. You guys, have a great day. And I appreciate each and every one of you. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one on Cool Wheels. Take care of yourself. I'm out.